This short video will show how to import bibliographic records via Z3950 in Sitka's Evergreen. To access the Z3950 interface, go to Cataloging, Import Record from Z3950. The Z3950 interface will display with your default search services selected. Check the boxes for any additional services you'd like searched. It is best practice to always have local catalogs selected. Enter your search term and click search. Your results will display at the bottom. You can click the arrows to hide the top sections of the screen. Take a look at the service column for the results. If a search result has the service native evergreen catalog, that means there's a matching record already in the Sitka database. Select that record and click View Mark. Look at the mark record to confirm that it matches what you have in hand. If it does, click Cancel at the bottom of the pop-up and then click Show in Catalog. The existing record will open in a new tab and you can add your holding to it. If the Sitka record doesn't match your item or if there are no matches to the Sitka database, Select each result in turn and click View Mark to determine which of your results is the best match for your item. Once you've determined the best match, select it and click Edit then Import. Make any needed edits to the record. As this record has not yet been added to the Sitka database and so has no items from other libraries attached, you can edit it as needed. At the very least, we recommend removing any fields that contain local data related to items held by the service the record comes from. In general, this information will be found in the 852 and 9xx fields. Ignore the Add Item checkbox as the Fast Add Item feature is not currently available. Once you've made the needed edits, click Import. Next, click Go to Record. The record will open in the catalog in a new tab. You can now add your holdings to the record. See the video Adding Holdings for information on adding holdings to a record. Thank you for watching this video. For more information, please visit the BC Libraries Cooperative website.